100 releases is a testimony to the success of the program itself. I know that everybody that sees this release will just love it. It's just a great way to train and we know people get results from it. We are the experts on high rep training, so it's up to us to really lead the fitness industry through this scientific journey. My father, Les, competed in four Olympic Games in New Zealand. My mother also was a track and field athlete, and my sister and I both represented New Zealand in track and field. We opened our first commercial gym in 1968. Back then, it was nothing, it was tiny. The whole commercial gym industry had barely been born. I saw the birth of, of aerobics uh, when I was at university in the US and I bought a friend of mine from the UCLA track team who'd been teaching aerobics there down to New Zealand to help us get started with, with it. I'd had a year in the music industry, in the rock and roll industry. We had a lot of friends there, so I, I brought in a lot of people who were incredible performers and a lot of elite athletes, people that we'd trained with. So we really took the old aerobic dance sort of classes and, and transformed them into sports classes with dumbbells and with machines for circuit training and ultimately to body pump, which of course you know, became maybe the world's most popular workout right now. We brought resistance training to the masses. People who normally wouldn't want to lift weights on the gym floor are now doing body pump and bringing the effects of resistance training to that group has been phenomenal. The first time I saw body pump was at Phylex convention in Sydney in uh, 1995 and the Kiwis came over, did this pump class, I knew nothing about it. At the end of the class I was just buzzing and I was like, where can I do this class? It was different because you had to follow set choreographies, but I loved the feeling of weight training. And of course, my body completely shaped up. The rep effect is what we consider you get out of a body pump program. So normally you would go into a gym and you might do five exercises and lift eight to 12 repetitions, maybe four sets of those. In body pump, you're doing about 800 to 1,000 reps with each workout. We like to come up with the best training solutions for people in a group fitness environment. So research and providing the evidence behind what we do has become a big part of who we are. When we launched Body Pump, it just somehow struck a chord. It went nuts. Almost immediately, we had 200 people in a class. And then an Australian gym owner, Bill Robertson, saw it and said, look, can I have the national agency for this? This is incredible. And within a year or so, we had a few hundred gyms. And we just realised that we had a model that worked and we found agents around the world and it just took off. We know that people work better in a social environment. We know that people like to exercise with a friend. Group fitness maximises that. We call it the group effect. They know the instructor, they've got some mates there, and they're all sort of going towards the same goals. People love it. They don't want to miss a class. So that's taking people from exercising because they have to, to exercising because they want to. It actually blows my mind. Um, when we go to big live events and there's 2,000, 3,000, 4,000 people there, and they just love body pump. Every time we release something new, it's, it's got some new innovation and uh, it's an exciting journey to be, have been part of it for this long. With Body Pump 100, it's about everybody. It's the community of instructors and trainers that we have around the globe. January the 14th is the global launch day for Body Pump 100. We will be teaching that class all day long, all over the world, in thousands of gyms with tens of thousands of teachers, and we'll be going for the world's biggest workout. We really wanted to bring that joy of exercise and health and fitness and movement to, to people's lives. It's something my dad said, it's the job of the fitness industry to make people fall in love with fitness. And I think that's an incredibly powerful mission statement.